Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to see Halloween themed math activities. So it's going to be a fun based learning and I'll be sharing the link to this printable in my description box below. So please do check to it and share in your review as well. But don't forget to tweak the activities as per your child's interest and level. So come, let's get started. It's a simple oral therapy activity. Here I have provided few ghost cards with the answers. So what he needs to do is he needs to count the green ghost, write the numbers in the square and make a sum out of it. So once he gets the answer, he needs to use the straw and suck the correct ghost card and place it over there. Are you ready Aram? Yes. Yeah. Start. So how many green ghosts are here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six and five equals to eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six. In this zero, so I'm going to write zero. And in this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Six and nine equals to fifteen. So I'm going to suck fifteen up. The next activity is find the missing number to match the sum. So the sum here is 15. So he needs to find out 8 plus what makes 15. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Yeah. We need to find out 3 plus what makes 16. Okay. 3 and 7 makes 10. Then... Seven, uh, 10 and 6 makes 16 and me and seven, 7 and 6 makes 13 so 13 is the answer to, uh, 3 and 13 makes 16 okay so the next activity is connect the stickers and find the shape. So here using a ruler or freehand, uh, the kid just need to connect the stickers and find what shape it is and write the names here. So are you ready? Yes. Yes. You can use the ruler. Maybe I will. Thank you. So the next activity is skip counting up to 5 and Aram has been trained the Montessori way for skip counting and if anyone needs the video of the same then please let me know in the comment box below. So here what exactly he needs to do is it's just a simple counting of 2, 3, 4 and 5. So 2 times 2 and here I have provided the lace and some jack-o-lantern number cuts. So for example, if it's 2 times 2 is, he just needs to lace it like this. So, 2. So, the second time, it will be 4. So, 2 times 2 is 2. Four. Yeah, 2 times 2 is 4. And he needs to write the answer here. Now, it's counting by 5. So I'm going to start with 5. 2 times 5. 
2 times 5 is 10. Now 4 times 5 is 20. So the next activity is crack the code and find the answer. So here I have given the sum and E needs to give values for each ghost and find out the way to make the sum. Are you ready? Yes. Yeah. Take your pencil and the value here is 15. So I'm going to put 1, 5 right here, 1, 5 right here, 1, 5 right here. Okay. So, and for this, it's five because it's a ghost one day. And what, uh, how much value will this have to make seven? Two. Yes. And now this is two because it's a jack lantern. And this to make eight is to have to be three. Yes, it is. This also is 3 because it's a ghost. And this is 5. It's the next row. And this is 2. And 3. 5 and 2 makes 7. And 7 and 3 makes 10. So I'm going to write 10 right here. So the next activity is Halloween tic-tac-toe and here I have given some addition and subtraction and what exactly we need to do is like Ara will be taking the jack-o-lantern and I'll be taking the skeletons. So we have to tell the other I won tic-tac-toe okay. in the end of when we finish like this mm. or we can do like this. Yeah, yes. it has to be either a straight line or a standing line. And who is going to finish first will uh, be the winner, okay? I have to shout tic-tac-toe after we finish. Okay. okay, let's start. Okay, go, start. Yeah, you can pick. Okay. You can start, Amma. Okay, so 17 and 3 is 20. Now, because my mom is right here, I'm going to put mine right here. Okay. So, 36 plus 42. Little difficult, but I'll do it. I need to remove 6 from 10. So it will be 4. <laughs> 5 minus 3 is 2. I won! Tic tac toe! I missed it. <laughs> <laughs> So the next activity is find and write the number names. So he just needs to count the ghost or the jack-o-lantern and write the numbers. Okay. There are 10 ghosts and 3 ghosts more. So 13. What is this? Cat. <laughs> It looks like a caterpillar. <laughs> One caterpillar. So the next activity is odd number versus even number. And he needs to use these googly eyes to find whether it is the, the number I have given is odd or even. Actually to make it short, odd number is 
the number that comes without a friend and even number comes with a friend or a pair okay, okay. Aram, are you ready so you need to tell me whether 5 is a odd number or even number Five doesn't have a friend. That's why it's odd. So four has a pair and it's even. doesn't have a friend so it's odd so the next activity is just a color by code here i have given few simple addition numbers and um, the answer is matched to a color code so for example here it is 10 and 1 10 and 1 makes 10 plus 1 makes 11 so what is the color code for 11 Light green. I'm going to take it right here. Four. Five plus four is nine. So nine. Nine is pink. I like pink. It's my favorite color. This is just a sample activity that you can do with younger kids. So what exactly we need to do with this activity is we just need to roll the dice and count the dots and place either a Halloween character over it or any stickers too. And for this, this is just a spider web and we need to create maybe like a 10 spider webs or something and write number here. For example, here it's three. So the kid has to place either um, coins or doll here we have spiders so I'm going to place three spiders so it's just a number versus quantity activity and here it's a graphing so we need to count how many jack-o-lanterns are here and here it is one two three four five six seven so we need to color seven rows and same for the ghost and we can ask the kid like which is more here as i said before this is just a sample worksheet for younger kids so that's why i didn't went in detail you can tweak the worksheet as per your kids interest i hope you all found this video interesting and helpful too i have shared the link to this printable in my description box below so please do check it out and share in your review as well and if you haven't subscribed yet to our channel, then please take a moment to subscribe and share in your love and support. Thanks a lot for your time and support. Take care and have a cheerful day.